now it is official. Mattel CEO Margot Giordatis is stepping down, and the new CEO will be Enon Kreitz. Enon Kreitz had previously been named as the chairman of the board. He now will become CEO of Mattel, effective on April 26th. It looks like uh, Margot Giordatis will be taking another opportunity in the technology sector. She's going to stay on during the transition, but she was only there for about a year. Uh, Mr. Kreitz has pre had previously been CEO at a global digital media and content company. So here we go. That was very fast, but Mattel now has a new CEO. Shares, though, down in response more than 3%. Kelly, back over to you. Wow, Courtney, thank you. Let's put up a chart of uh, Hasbro and Mattel over the past year. You can kind of see uh, the pressure that was on this CEO, the much ballyhooed hire uh, as she was from the tech world. Um, came in in a very difficult environment, obviously, to be in the toys business, especially with uh, Toys R Us going out of business. But Mattel down 46% over a year, Mike. Hasbro down 12%. Yeah, it, it tells you that there's not an easy fix, uh, and probably anybody who's coming in there is not necessarily going to have the answer. So. Uh, you know, I don't know what, what the, uh, the rejoinder is on this one because it's going to be a little bit of a tough period for a while. And this, the reports came out from Dow Jones just yeah, before the exactly. close that there might be, that she might be on her way out and now already they're, yeah, they're having somebody come in and kind of take over here. Um, Steph, what would you do? Would you own uh, these names? Do there, does there need to be more consolidation? Well, there probably is going to be more consolidation. I wonder if this opens the door for Hasbro yeah. to buy them. I'm not sure. I would just say I'm not sure what you get because they've got a lot of old line toys. Lot, they have really not kept up in the digital era to the extent Hasbro has actually much better. So I don't know if they really want to, you know, combine with the kind of an old school type of company. They have some great brands, that's for sure. But I don't know if that's the direction they need, they need to go into. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.